My name is Uncle Hack. And if I was to sleep with either Cher or Madonna, I would have to say Cher. I spent a good portion of my youth in uh, hockey locker rooms getting prepped up to uh, Cher's greatest hits prior to stepping on the ice. I think she has better bops, personally. Uncle Hack, how are you? I'm good, how are you? Don't ask me that. How long have you been a computer nerd? Eight months. Would you say that your mustache is more Dr. Phil or Uncle Phil? Mm, maybe a blend between uncle and daddy. It's like if worlds collide, Power Man 5000, you know? Is there something sexual about that? Like that, it's very sexual. Hmm. Pounding. How much G-force would you say that is? 69. We're on a Canada-wide tour right now. Correct. As we sit here. Mm -hmm. Who do you hate more, Quebecers or Newfies? And why do you hate them so much? It's like saying, do I hate trans or blacks? Hmm. Those are your words, not mine. Hmm. So no answer? <laughs> <laughs> if I was to give you an answer, I would probably say Newfies. The smell? Probably the language. Big barrier there. Can't understand them. It's like pebbles in their mouth, you know? You ever had loose change in a pop bottle? In my mouth, but not in a pop bottle. Mm. You know the taste that it leaves in your mouth? Similar. Copper? Yes. Hmm. I see you guys sell a get cash eat ass flag on your website. Care to explain? Well, it's, it's very deep, you know. A lot of people don't understand it, right? Because they spend a lot of their time just gallivanting the earth with no thoughts inside their heads. Hmm. And this is like, it is the core values of what we stand for with this brand. And that's getting cash and also eating ass. While gallivanting. Correct. Good word. Um, time to answer a question from your Twitter feed. This is a real reply mm -hmm. someone made on one of your tweets. Mm -hmm. um, at John ADE 04822832 says, mm. quote, I suggest you should message back Andrew underscore tech 12 on Instagram so he can help you fix it back. Mm. What's that mean to you? To fix it back. Hmm. There must be, I think that must be like one of those QAnon messages that a lot of people have. Oh, oh nice. You're right there. We got receipts. Andrew Tech on Instagram. He can help you fix it back. Hmm. You think maybe he meant throw it back? <laughs> hmm. I do. Do you need help throwing it back? From time to time. Perhaps throwing that ass in a circle? More of a square. Political question time. Mm -hmm. You can put that down. Yeah. If you were president, which serial killer would you pardon? Hmm. It's a deep question. Out of all the serial killers, you know, I think all the good ones have already passed on. They're on to their next uh, life. So, I mean, if it was back in time. I think John Wayne Gacy was very interesting. He had, uh, you know, he had a very nice stage presence. I think the clown makeup was something that was very unique in that time. Dahmer was uh, kind of, of a cliche type serial killer where Gacy went the extra mile to terrify the children with clown makeup. And I find that to be like the next level. He went the extra mile and targeted a very targeted group most erotic, you might say. Yeah. Lastly, please look into the camera, state your name, and tell the people if you'd rather sleep with Cher or Madonna and why. You want my real name or? No. Alias. Uh, alien, please. Alien, okay. <clears throat> my name is Uncle Hack. And if I was to sleep with either Cher or Madonna, I would have to say Cher. I spent a good portion of my youth in uh, hockey locker rooms getting prepped up to uh, Cher's greatest hits prior to stepping on the ice. I think she has better bops, personally.
Very fair. Thank you.